I was watching some uh, Gomer Pyle last night. You know, there's a few episodes of Gomer Pyle that I'm amazed. You know, he was some of the episodes, two episodes that I watched last night. Uh, Sergeant Carter, you know, Frank Sutton. Uh, I'm amazed they allow that on TV. I mean, he was exceptional. A couple episodes I watched, I mean, you're talking about yelling. Uh, I think, you know, they're supposed to have these sensors on television. And that's, you know, that's, 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 that's no full, what I'm trying to say here, that's BS. I mean, them two episodes that I watched, I mean, it, it's kind of hard for me to watch it, and I'm an adult. But boy, there's two episodes of the Gomer Pile, that excessive yelling. I'm amazed they would, you know, produce put their time into filming. I mean, there, you know, there's a line to be drawn. I mean, there was so much yelling that it almost wasn't a good show. It actually got on, you know, I'm an adult, it actually got on my nerves a little bit. But I, but the, the difference is between me and the kid, I understand it. You know, when I was, you know, when I was a kid, you know, those shows are in, 19, I think the copyright 1968. Well, those reruns when I was a kid, and that's got to hurt a kid psychologically. I mean, damn, I mean, Jesus. I mean, just two episodes that I watched last night, I'm thinking, why do they, uh, it's okay for him to yell a little bit, but he was really, I mean, raising all kind of hell. You know, for television, that's just a little too much. I mean, I mean, just you know, just I mean, Frank Sutton was an amazing actor. He nailed that part. I want to emphasize, he nailed that part. Whoever casted him for that part, Frank Sutton for Gilmer Pyle, knew what they was doing. He was perfect for that part. I love to hear him yell, but there's two episodes I watched last night that just little too much for television. You know, uh, just godly, man. I'm thinking, you know, uh, in the 70s, I seen that. You know, I was, you know, uh, 73, I was 10 years old. Too young, too young for that, too young. Oh, God, my kid would never watch that. I don't know if I'd let my teenager watch it. I mean, just I hate to say it. I mean, he. The problem here is Frank Sutton was so good at it that you really thought. I think he was. I looked him up. I think he was really. He wasn't in the Marines. Never was. He was in the Army. Uh, but he was so good at acting. His acting so amazing. Of course, better acting like that would hurt a kid more psychologically. But his acting was so good. You think he's a really? You think he was a really? Uh, was a real Marine drill sergeant? Amazing actor, and he make they you know they make it look so damn easy, and it's not. My hats are off to him. Rest in peace, uh, Frank Sutton. He was an amazing you know amazing actor. I mean, uh, uh, he deserved an award for that. But filming it and putting it on television is two different. Two whole different things. You know, he has no control. He signed the he signed the contract. He has no control of what goes over television. I'm amazed he let it over television. I really am. Even for the seventies. But he he was yelling so much after I watched it, I actually had trouble going to sleep. Yeah, and I'm a and I'm a grown man. It just that you know, just good lord, just Man, you know, for a comedy, a little overboard. I know it's not a perfect world, but they could have trimmed him down just a little bit.